What's up everybody, it's your humble host Picasso here. And we're just looking at a quick app. It's a third party keyboard for your Android device. It's called Chroma or Chroma. Actually, let me go ahead and check just to make sure. Um, I believe it's Chroma keyboard. I'm pretty sure I'm also late to the party because I think this keyboard has been out for a while. Here it is, it has two O's. So I'm gonna say Chroma keyboard. Okay, let's dive into the settings here. Now, uh, Chroma keyboard, uh, Chroma keyboard has what it's called adaptive, uh, sorry, adapt keyboard color. Basically, it's going to change the keyboard color to match whatever application it's opened in. So we're going to go ahead and check that out. Um, it's got some different styling here. You can have a flat color. You can have a palette color, a gradient color, or a center gradient color. I'm actually going to go with the gradient color. The flat color is all right. Center gradient is what I've been using it on. Um, either way, it's pretty cool. You can change the keyboard size here. I'll leave it at 100, which is default. Then we, oh, just took a snapshot, sorry about that. Then we have some uh, invisible hotspots on the screen right now, so. Um, we have the number row enabled. Uh, you can enable split layout, okay, to use your thumbs, uh, make it for typer, uh, blah, blah, blah. Enable split layout to make thumb typing easier. Okay, now I suggest that's much better for using a tablet, so just keep that in mind. And of course, landscape split once you've enabled split layout. Uh, we have the show the symbols key on one-handed mode reduction so you can change the size which i'm not going to mess around with that too much but you guys can fool around with it if you want um keep in mind there will be links in the description below if you want to check out the application as well so over here in the settings we have auto capitalization double space period voice input emoji key etc etc vibrate on key press and so forth you know basic stuff that all the third-party keyboards come with uh within the settings uh, settings, synchronization, restore purchases, um, because basically, uh, as it says here, if you got the app when it was a paid app, you can unlock all the features for free by following the wizard up there. Okay, um, let's see here. Yeah, so pretty straightforward. Let's go ahead and bring it out and test it out. Now, Chroma Keyboard uh, Pro here, which is the Pro, so it's now free. So as you see, here's the keyboard. I have the number pad enabled. So that's pretty cool. And it matches the app, which is basically a red app. So it matches the app. Okay, let's go ahead and try it in a different application. Let's go ahead and open up Instagram, which is normally a blue application. Oh, that's a nice theme. Shout out to Dare to Win. Um, you know, she always asks me for some tips when it comes to theming. And I think this is her, yeah, there it is. Team Iron Man, her current screen. I'm gonna go ahead and give that a like right there. That's awesome. I like that. I like that. So let's bring up the keyboard and let's see uh, what color the keyboard is now. Come on. Oh, it didn't come up. I, uh, do I have to type something? I have to go to type something. Yes, allow Instagram to use whatever. And let's go ahead and search. And there's the keyboard. So I didn't go into any keyboard settings. There's no cut. There's no editing or anything like that. It's the exact same keyboard. It just adapted to the application. And now, as you see here, it is a, a darkish gradient mixed blue. Let's go to keep. Let's bring up the keyboard. There it is. It's yellow following the keep. And what else do we have? Um, something different that will give us a different color. Let's, I don't even know, but you, you, you get the idea. It's, it's pretty straightforward. Let's open up Facebook. Let's bring up the keyboard. I'm assuming it's going to be a blue keyboard. Let's bring it up. Yep, it's a blue keyboard. So very awesome. I mean, it's, pre it's pretty cool. It's Kruma Keyboard Pro. It is free. Let's go in and check in the Play Store real quick and see if it's actually in there because I did not get it from the Play Store, <laughs> but I'm sure that it is in there. Uh, App Swaps keeps crashing. And of course, you see here, it has a silverish, I want to say silverish, white, uh, 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 grayish background. So let's go ahead and check in Kruma keyboard and it does show up there. Okay, there it is right there as you see it. So it's in the Play Store, it is free. So I'll give the Play Store link and I'll give the link um, from where I got it from. And that's gonna wrap it up for Chroma keyboard. Checking out this awesome keyboard that does definitely give you the opportunity to have a pretty uh, 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 flexible keyboard where basically it just adapts to any color that uh, uh whichever any color pertaining to the application that you are in so it's very awesome the keyboard always changes i really like that you have the number row which is now available in the updated google keyboard i believe you have that option to turn that on so 
keep that in mind. Links below in the description if you want to check it out. Leave a thumbs up on the video if you appreciate. If you the leave a thumbs up on the video if you enjoyed. I'm your humble Picasso. I'll see you in the next one, guys. Peace. I'm out.